It's my honor to present the guided meditation and healing heart evening. We've been going through weeks and weeks of beautiful layers of music and guided meditations as some of you may have participated with and some of you it may be your first night. My name's Carrie and I'm at Anabuti Retreat Center remote. I'm in Oregon physically and um, I'll be your host in a way tonight, just like an MC kind of setting the stage. We're going live on Facebook in a little bit, but the people in the Zoom room, you have a special privilege of sharing afterwards if you'd like to stay after Facebook closes at 7.30. It's really good to see all of you here. Um, and I'm looking forward to this topic. I have to admit today was one of my worst uncheerful days. So I don't know about you, but this topic is really good um, to face in the midst of so much that's going on possibly that could bring us down or could change our emotions. But tonight, meditations about remaining cheerful within. And not, ooh, my battery's, my battery's low here, so. So maybe that's symbolic of my own inner battery. The soul battery needs to be recharged as well. So totally looking forward to this evening. Thank you for all attending. Good to see your faces and you can keep your video on or off. It depends on how you'd like to be. It's, it's really nice to see the faces um, when in some ways for the meditator guide and the harpist to have it be like they're in the real room with you. So nice to see you, Victoria, David, Madeline. Hey. So hope you enjoy this evening and I will be here meditating with you too. Tonight, let me see on this stage, could we switch to the stage? Let's see. We have Kyoko who is the harpist. She, yeah, she's an amazing <laughs> sweet, Angel soul, a meditator for so long, and she teaches Raj Yoga. So when you hear her play, you will know that she's meditating as well as sending vibrations to you through the heart. She's also sending vibrations to you from her intent. So you can focus in on that and feel that um, growing within you with the pieces that she's made for uplifting us tonight and inspiring the cheerfulness to come and bubble up within us. And is it uh, Sukanya Ben who will be speaking tonight? Possibly, I think so. So welcome everybody. Yes, we'll have nice Sukanya Ben have and Chandru Ben will be joining us as well. Oh, Chandru Ben will join us too. Chandru Ben is our senior sister for the West Coast. and. She is an amazing gift to have with us tonight. Thank you for Tanuj Bai. He's the guy behind the scenes, but he's making it all happen. So teamwork makes the dream work. <laughs> and plus we're all together creating the vibrations in this place and on the video so that when people watch it on Facebook later, they'll feel the positive vibrations and the cheerfulness bubble up inside them too. So that's the intent and thank you again. Om Shanti.
Shanti. Today we have the greatest fortune to meditate along with Sister Chandru. Sister Chandru is the director of the San Francisco Meditation Center, Anubhuti Meditation and Retreat Center. and also the West Coast coordinator of the organization. She has been a yogi for more than 60 years. She took these spiritual teachings directly from the founding father, Brahma Baba. So you are all invited to take her spiritual drishti. Drishti is the pure vision, the soul conscious vision the vision of the third eye, the soul. You can receive that strength, that peace. From her being, the soul, that sits at the third eye location, the center of the forehead. So from time to time, you can, you can focus on the center of her forehead. She has her unbroken connection with the Supreme Divine, Shiv Baba, Supreme Soul, Supreme Father Shiva, the Supreme Light. We all gain from the vibrations that will be created from her presence. She recently had stroke. She is recovering from stroke. But her spiritual vibrations, her purity, her meditation has been unbroken throughout. When we accept the reality and work towards overcoming it, there is deep happiness within and cheerfulness surfaces on the face.
sit and relax in this feeling and make yourselves alert to this truth we are spiritual beings beings that are beyond matter yet working with matter working through our bodies spiritual beings making the human experience divine feel this in your heart feel this truth you are a divine being of pure light this body the being the light sits in the center of the brain on the surface the location is the center of the forehead the being the divine being open yourselves to this truth that you the being the pure light is divine in its innate nature as i go through life i make the human experience divine for myself and others feel this in your heart so kitten let this thought let this experience touch the depths of the consciousness let us hold this in silence for some time
when I see events, situations as various scenes in this eternal drama. When I have that reference, as I come across people, circumstances, behaviors, with the reference of being in a theater, having a character, a role to play. And so does everyone. We are acting, performing our best on the stage. And so is each one giving their best in their performance according to their understanding. With this reference, I stay detached, I stay loving, I stay cheerful. content, okay, and keep improving my performance.
As is my awareness, so is my vision. I keep in my awareness in the depths of my consciousness, my being, that I am a very fortunate soul. carry a lot of good karma, good actions performed in my past and also in the present. That keeps my fortune high. Whenever I have done something good towards others at the right time, something that was required by someone offering cooperation maybe or giving strength, courage whatever was required. In those moments, I have received blessings from those people, from their heart. Those blessings are with me they create my fortune. In this awareness of I the being, a soul, a spiritual light. I awaken to the truth that I am child of the Supreme Divine the bestower of fortune. The one whose eternal name is Shiva, Shiv Baba, the supreme light, the bestower of fortune for all. The Supreme Father and the Supreme Mother of all of us is the one who is bestower of fortune. fortunate being, a fortunate soul.
with this awareness i see my life filled with immense fortune attainments gifts i the soul i carry with myself throughout my journey these eternal attainments and gifts and blessings in this awareness i see everyone as a fortunate being everyone is the child of the one the bestower of fortune everyone is carrying their fortune their gifts their attainments with them everyone i feel confident i feel happy within i am so full i am content as i keep sharing my gifts my eternal gifts my eternal fortune with others they happily share theirs with me and there's exchange of very pure energy of cheerfulness of happiness sister oh chats all of you can join oh Oh, oh, oh. 
sound of om vibrates the internal organs of the body silences the brain the thoughts purifies the heart sends this message of peace in the atmosphere om shanti means with my thoughts speech and actions i offer peace to the world
ओम शांति थैंक यू एवरी वन फॉर ज्वाइनिंग टूडेज मेडिटेशन वॉज वेरी वेरी स्पेशल सिस्टर कैरी आई रिक्वेस्ट यू टू टेक इट फॉरवर्ड was a special meditation and to end it with om like that was a nice reminder to just use those simple tools sometimes when we're feeling blue to count our blessings to really think of how much we have to be grateful for and then even just that simple oming i'm sure it's taking sister shandru through so much and she still keeps smiling and blessing people and so nice thank you sisters and thank you to our facebook people who have joined us it's so nice even if you can't be on zoom you've been in our room in a way our soul room our hearts and joining in thank you so much for being here and share the facebook post leave a comment your 